addicts welcome back to another episode of you guys choose my skyrim adventure um i've been so excited to get back into this game again and i also just wanted to take a second to say to you guys i have been exclusively playing sims for a very long time and whenever i played anything other than sims even on my second channel people would ask where sims was since we started playing this playthrough people keep asking me when are we playing skyrim next and it makes me so happy. Well, the music literally went in time to that. Um, it makes me so happy. And I'm really excited to play Skyrim with you guys. And it was just so cool um, knowing that you guys were excited for it as well. So as we get in, I uh, just wanted to say thank you because it makes me really happy. And um, as we get into the next episode, we had a poll at the end of last episode to know what we are going to be doing next. And I can now reveal the answers of the poll. So in fifth place with 141 votes on YouTube and 47 votes on Twitch was the College of Winterhold, 118 votes in total. In fourth place was the Thieves Guild in Riften with 100 on YouTube and 132 on Twitch, 232 in, in total, fourth place. In third place was Build a House. You guys on YouTube were 245 and on Twitch it was 67, uh, 69, which is 314 in total. And then in second place, the Dark Brotherhood. Now, we are currently in Windhelm, and I think I can kind of trigger start the quest to it while I'm there. So I will do that because it came second with 255 on YouTube and 118 on Switch for 373. But in first place, you guys are obviously very excited for Dragons because this actually won on both channels with 447 on Switch and 212 on YouTube. Six, five, nine votes in total. We're about to get Doverkeen. Uh, because we are gonna trek to Helgen today. I'm gonna try and do it on horseback and um, because my whole squad will have horses and our squad is now up to two because we've got a Caden and we've also got um what is she called? Uthgird. Uthgird as well. So let's get back into it. We'll trigger the Dark Brotherhood quest and then we'll get the whole gang on horses and we will do a little adventure over to Helgen um and i'm really excited to play again so here is how we left things we were just vibing in the pub i think it's late yeah it's 11 p.m at night yes. i did mean to download a no helmets mod and i totally what forgot so um i will do that next time if any of you guys already use a no helmets mod You're looking yeah a bit under the weather. i know i'm looking sick i think i've got food poisoning again because god help me i can't help but eat raw meat in fact can i cook some of my meat right now um what was i saying oh yeah we'll make some stew and stuff we'll make a stew <laughs> we'll make a stew um every time i want to pray i have to pay 100 pounds the robin robbers um but we're just gonna rest and get a little sleep because then i get the well rested bonus let's get ourselves a good eight hours sleep in skyrim is actually better than sleep in real life there you go no student debt and also a good night's sleep hot kettle cafe thank you so much if any of the three months in a row that sounds like a cozy cafe name um but yeah if any of you guys know any good no helmet mods please let me know because um i like to be able to see my cute face which we will also edit before we leave so let's get somewhere nice and bright in fact it might be sunny outside we might be able to see outside and we will just check our wares and stuff before we leave we've got to be um prepared you know we've got to be nice and prepared Oh, and a lot of you guys said you've bought Skyrim since I've started playing this, which is so cool. I wonder on which device you bought it on. Was it on PC? Was it on console? Or was it on Switch? Or was it on your pager? Because let's face it, what can't you get this game on now? I'm not sure. You can get it on more or less everything. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to sell some bits and bobs. Yep. Would you like to buy some things from me? Blades, I have helmets. way too much stuff. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Like, oh, do I? Isn't I think I'm going to sell this vampire armor because I can get vampire armor really easily. I'm going to disenchant that. Um, Have you got any lockpicks for sale? Yeah, you've got one. I'm going to buy that because you always want lockpicks. Can I use this forge to any make plane. anything and just up my skills a little bit? Um, naked helmet that can be crafted to help hide outfit helmet not so sure about that one no nothing nothing else we can make just yet but let me just nip in here as well yeah, you can never have too many lock picks it's actually very true there's a quest from these two so i'm just gonna listen to them whilst oh look at that little blue light 
don't know what it is, but I love it. <laughs> Just, uh, <laughs> That's how eyes work in real life. Contextual helmet equipping mod that takes it off and puts it on during oh. combat. Oh, Hufflepuff, that sounds like my kind of mod. Okay, we will definitely give that a go. Look at me just failing every potion. Okay, we got a few though. And at least I'll be able to sell them, get a bit of cash, cure my... Oh, can you sell me a potion of cure disease? So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Potion... Oh, you've got four. They cost 200 pounds each though. <sighs> Why you have to be so expensive? Do you have a recipe for it? <gasps> oh, you are useless, sir. Okay, do you want to buy my potions, please? You can buy that. You can buy all seven of those. You can buy... I can't bother with regeneration. Am I just lazy? I don't know, but I can't bother with regeneration. Blend that. I also can't bother with stamina. I'll just wait for it. I need the money more than I need stamina, you know? Um... Yeah, that's me done, friend. Oh, you can have that one. No, you can't. That's mine. Um, and I'm going to buy one more potion of cure disease because you know what I'm like. Potion of cure disease is vampire ash and mud crab claw. Oh my gosh, I literally had those things. Oh, I could work, kick though. myself. I finally derived the location of the white file. So this is a, a mission you can do. And it's worth just getting get it on our quest list, you know? I'll get the you white file for you. It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help us, an old man. Us, I was going to say us mudcrabs have maker, to stick together, but no. <laughs> us dark elves have to stick to together, although you might be a wood elf. Toronto I can't really tell. I'll get it, don't worry. Just don't, just give me the instructions. Don't that's all you need, that's all you need, friend. I'll get it for you. Um, Emma Murphy, thank you so much for 12 months in a row. My useless and Dana, here. thank you so much for gifting a sub. If you gifted by Dana, please make sure you say a big thank you in the chat. You should buy ingredients to increase your skill. Buying, that's an interesting concept. The eight guide you to this the is more interesting though. I feel so bad. I'm like, yeah, I'll help you. But I'll also rob you blind. What do you got back here? Ooh, I'm hungry. Yeah. You can't take that. I don't appreciate loiterers. If that's what you're here to do. I did no such thing, sir. I, I'm, a, I'm a good elf. I only stole. Uh, they took. They caught me stealing a plate. Like, no, it's not. Oh, he's an altmer. Oh. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Uh, it's one gold. Smart woman. Now come along with us. We'll take any stolen goods and you'll be free to go. After you pay the fine, of course. <laughs> not all my stolen things. All I stole was a bowl. You know, it was just one bowl. I think you're being ridiculous. I actually think you're being ridiculous over a bowl. I'm just going to eat all my bread and think about what I've done. And I'll eat all my carrots too. And I'll eat some chess. Wow. One bowl? Imagine getting that upset about a bowl. It's a bowl. Okay. Right, and how am I doing otherwise? How am I doing... <laughs> Me and my mum always say this. How am I doing in myself? Um, I need to cure my disease. So look at me. See that little flash? That means my diseases are cured. And active effects. We're good. We're laughing. As a Dwemer, a Dunmer, sorry, you are assumed to be a self-serving Daedric worshipper. Well, if the boot fits, I don't mind being that. Uh, while we're here, we're going to trigger the Dark Brotherhood questline. And then we're going to go grab our horses and head on the old town road and ride till we can't no more and go to Helgen. So that should be fun. Let's keep doing some little steals of things. Also, let's get away from this god awful fr frostbitten town. It's too cold. What's your business here? <laughs> Emotional eat in Skyrim. Okay. So if my memory serves me correctly, I think there is a child. Then it's true, what everyone is saying. That Aventus Artino is doing the Black Sacrament, trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Yes. Oh, 
talk to Aventus Artino. I think he's in here. What? Oh, he's gonna go knock at his door. That boy, that house, they are cursed. Then I'm right. I knew it. He's trying to have somebody kill. All right. I won't deny it, child. Okay, so this kid's trying to do a black sacrament. We're gonna try and break into the house. See what Kraki's up to. In we go. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Just normal kids' nursery rhymes. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Oh, what has happened here? This is wreckish. Hey, how long must I do this? I keep praying night, mother. Why won't you answer me? Are Why? you all right, child? It worked! I knew you'd come! I just knew it! I did the black sacrament over and over with the body and the things. And then you came! An assassin from the Dark Brotherhood! <gasps> yes! Uh, of course! The, the, black, the black sacrament! It took so long. So very long. But now that you're here, you can accept my contract. C -c 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 contract My mother, she... She died. I... I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften. Honor Hall! The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. She is, to be fair. They call the kind. But she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us! She is. So I ran away. She does deserve a little... And <laughs> the black sacrament. Now you're here. And you could kill Grelod the Kind. Deal done. You have my word, small child with cool hair. Okay, so that's on our list of things we can do. Some of you guys are saying it's quiet. Do you guys need me to turn up the game volume a little bit? And here is the uh, the little sacrament he was doing. He wanted to summon the Dark Brotherhood. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just take the things you used to, to summon. In Riften? This is probably your family's flesh, but I'm gonna use it in a potion for myself. The sound is good. Okay. Turn the game volume up just a tiny bit. That I can do. Okay, I've switched it to minus nine. It was on minus 11. So hopefully that is a little bit louder for you. Um, also, just a reminder, you can do exclamation mark mod list if you want to grab my mod list. Um, there we go. Yeah, seriously, Sana, I'm so excited. I've not bought them yet. Um, I have never worn... It's a sari, right? Never worn one before, so I don't really uh, even know where to go. But I'm going to ask my friend whose wedding it is, and I'm excited. <laughs> I'm just... I just love weddings, you know? Okay, so we're going to help... I, I know that we didn't vote for the Dark Brotherhood this time, Please but it's always been something show. you guys have been really kind of interested in. Fine. So I figured we'd at least get it going. I'm going to stop picking up raw meat because clearly I can't... I can't be trusted, can I? <laughs> I picked it up all the same. And I'm just going to rob this child on his own blind. Um, he don't need these things, let's face it. He's kind of on his own at this point. The odds aren't in his favor, so they may as well be in mine. Um, you can have your merchant's clothes, boy. And he wants us to get revenge on the orphanage owner in Riften. However, that's all well and good, but we're not heading to Riften right now. We are heading to Helgen, which is... Actually, it's on my journal, isn't it? Um, Live another life. Begin my new life. But where is, where is Helgen? Trouble in Skyrim. I'm trying to think where Helgen is. Uh, where do we start? Okay. It's Helgen up here. Helgen, there it is. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's far. Where are we right now? Okay, it's doable. It's doable, but we're going to need ourselves a horse. So let's get this show on the road. Um, where is... Oh, I need to call Caden. Let me go grab Caden. He's still... He's still having a drink. He's got show leave syndrome. So let's go grab him. That is a long hike, Come isn't it? In. Let me know if you need anything <laughs> or take a seat by the fire and I'll yeah, Is he here? Over. There he is. Okay, Caden, yes. let's go. Guess we better get going. Oh, also he has some thoughts on... Um, well, you did have some thoughts. Hmm. He he wanted to ask me about gr 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 the thingy then, but he's gone now. 
Oh, that was a shame. I wanted to know what his thoughts were on it. Look, I'm sure we had some great interesting thoughts. He might bring them up again if we do follow that line. You guys loved Caden as well in the comments. Here he is. Hi, Caden. What's on your mind? Did you know that this was built by Yves Grimoire himself? Just a hint to what the cities in Admora must have looked like. alert noise off. Oh, that that's really really cool, Caden. I'm glad you're such um, a history buff. Sorry, my game my game halts when I I tap out, but luckily it doesn't freeze. Looking at you, Call of Duty. Oh, cool. That's nice. Thanks, Caden. My dad would like you because he likes history. So that's cool. Right, off we go. <laughs> Roses are red. Thank you so much for the twelve months. Have some flowers. And Kitty Gamer, thank you so much for the 19 months in a row. I'm glad you're watching with a cup of tea. That sounds so cozy. So yeah, we're going to leave Windhelm for now. It looks like a fort town, uh, village, uh, city. Tap, 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 town, village, city. It looks very fortish, doesn't it? It will, if we decide to do the main quest line, it will definitely come into play. Although the main quest line's difficult because both sides are kind of trash. So it's a bit of a shame because it is the main, the main thing. But both sides are a bit trash. Okay, we're going to freeze if we're not careful. So, uh, please, can I we'll get to know buy a better. horse? It's for sale if you've got the coin. I do. Here's my offer. That's your best offer? I suppose so. She's the one with the saddle. The saddle. Sometimes the difference between life and death. Okay, this one here is our horse scene. And I have a mod for horses. It hasn't come up right now, though. Maybe when we next get off our horse. And those guys should also have a horse. Let me just get off my horse and get back on. Wood but they, the they should have horses here. too. Yeah, convenient horses. There it is. Um, I want to improve my riding skills. Let's ride. Okay, Caden, where's your horse? Who's good? Where's your horse? I have follower horses. Why are they not getting on theirs? Oh! Oh! Uthgood had a horse then. Okay. Okay, she's got her horse. Caden, babes, are you just going to run the whole way there? I mean, cardio. Go for it if you want. And I can harvest things while mounted. I don't actually know how I'm doing that, but oh well. Am I going the right way? I keep doing that. I don't know what's the fastest way to get there. I'm probably going to have to go that way and then down. Okay. Let's ride! And I think this game's really... Pr ooh, ooh, signs. Signs, 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 signs. What's the fastest way to Helgen? White Run, Markarth, Riften, Solitude, Winterhold. We'll just go this way. It's fine. Caden prefers the exercise. Oh, jeez. Wolves. He does, right? Where are you, where are you at, Caden? Oh, how dare you? Where is Caden? Caden, this is why you get a horse, you fool. You could be hitting people on horseback like us. I'm trying to fight. It's kind of annoying, actually, trying to do it on horseback. It's fine. Death. We'll leave them to it. Oh, I don't have shoes. My shoes were stolen, so they took them away from me. We'll have to wear these sneaking boots instead. Oh my gosh, how sad. They stole my shoes! I can't believe anyone would do such a thing. We need to name the horse. Yeah, I think I can... Can I do that? We'll have a name for it in chat, though. What do you guys want to call the horse? Give me some suggestions and we'll do a little poll for it. I need to get away from the cold weather, though, because I am cold. Name it Elvira. Spirit. I like that. I need to get to warmer grounds and ASAPity sap saps. Am I going the right way? It gets cold. It gets warmer here. Let's try desperately to aim for this area. Otherwise, I'm going to die of cold, and that would be really embarrassing. Oh, okay. John Bubba Roach. I know what that's a reference to. How do I do... Um, how do I do always running? Is it C? Yeah, okay. If I just set her the right way, I can do the pull. Okay, I'm hoping she's going the right way. 
Okay. Horse name. Roach spirit. Um, Ash, I'm seeing. Uh, yogurt. Oh my gosh, I love that. Um, Jara. Okay, there we go. Right, you guys can start voting on the horse name. I'm going to make sure my character's still alive. Misa Linda, thank you so much for 19 months in a row. I never thought I'd enjoy Skyrim, but you make it so fun. I'm glad. I'm so glad you're enjoying it as much as I am. Right. Let's try and make it to warmth before we die of cold. We might have to take refuge in a cave if it gets too bad. It's a long ride to Helgen. I did say this. I only get five options for deciding um, in a poll, I'm afraid. So I can't take everyone's into account. Oh man, there's a lot of wolves here. I'm trying desperately to get to see that um, blue. Oh no, what have I done? I'm trying to get to that blue marker because it's not as snowy there and we might die of cold. I am now freezing. Oh my gosh, hawkers. Come on, go, horsey, go. I don't want to die. We've only just started, please. Spirit. Okay, we're going to call a horsey spirit. I like that. Right. Everyone pray for spirit the horse to get me there before we die of cold. It could be... Uh, the horse is trying his best. He can only run in short bursts, though. He's still a lot faster than we would be, trust me. I'm, I th I'm thinking we might have to stop in these burrows and take refuge from the cold. See on the map? There's something here. Can I go down it? Here we go. Koran Korangent. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go down here. Horse, go easy. Oh my gosh, please don't kill. Please don't die, horse. I just need to get out the cold for a second. Please be an entrance. <gasps> Who said that? Who's attacking me? Master look just to get out the snow? Oh, is this the exit? Oh, this is not good. Oh, I thought I had it. No! Get me inside! Get me inside! Is this not the entrance? Ah! No! Oh! Oh, you, you got a bag on your head, you weirdo! I need some money. There's no door here. Oh! Who oh, are these bagheads? Entrance is above the stairs. Oh, I can build camps, but I needed to get out from the snow or else I wouldn't have been able to heat up any. Oh, we got in there with a the final lockpick as well. Oh my gosh, it's brought us all the way back. It's fine. I think I'm going to try the opposite direction to get there anyway. That was pain, right? That was pure pain. M the Engineer, thank you so much for subscribing with Prime. You can welcome M the Engineer to the peaches, please. I was so proud of my lockpick in there as well. One lockpick on a master when I've not upgraded my lock... Oh, I've still got my feet out. When I've not upgraded my lockpick at all. Um, and it goes and does that to me. I'm sorry, but that's incredibly rude behavior. Okay, well, you know what's actually good sale, though? Got the coin. I'd like to give it a name. Um, oh. Wait, can't I choose a name? I want spirit. Okay, which one of these names is the closest to spirit? None of them. Um, I'm just going to look for a name beginning with S at this point. None of these. <laughs> Come on. Name beginning with an S. Not, no? Sigur. It's like huh? spirit, but you've been taking a sip of That's something halfway through. Offer? Okay. So. And now we can try sad. again. Okay, it's called spirit. I liked yogurt. I thought yogurt was a great name for a horse, genuinely. 
Um, okay, we're going to try this direction this time. And at least we've got shoes on from the start. Because let's face it, that was definitely a bit of an oversight last time. That won't have helped our cold stats. And I just need to get out the cold. A sippity subs. Wait, what's in this direction? Hmm. This might not be a good direction. Uh, could kind of go... Yeah, I think... I think we could do it. Is Caden with us? Yeah, but he's running. Ignore him. He's being a fool. Just just pretend it's not happening. Yeah, I should be quick saving more often. Thank you. Sigur Spirit. It's called Sigur Spirit. That's what our horse's name is. Sigur Spirit. Oh, this area is warm as well. This has got the hot swamps. I should definitely have just been going this route. What a fool. Sigur means powerful silence or peaceful victory. See, I love that. That's a vibe. Did they take my bow? Gosh, they took everything when they took my stolen things. I feel like I even stole my dignity and they, they took that as well. I know. Very sad. Very sad news. Oh, well, we, if we don't start the episode by immediately dying, have we even really started the episode? I don't think so. It's an old English name. There we go. Sigur Spirit. The old English horse. We've already cleared that cave. So let's continue. Continue as planned. Oh, yeah. That was a big giant. No, Jill. We've not started the main quest at all. We're just kind of vibing out, doing whatever we want to do. I rarely do the main quest in Skyrim. And I definitely... I think I've done the um, Civil War once. I just don't really bother with it very much. I like all the other stuff more. So, yeah. I did the main quest line when I played it for YouTube. Yet yeah, Caden wants to work on his legs. Caden doesn't skip leg day, so he's like, now nah, horses. Cheating. I don't skip leg day. Um, and he's going to run the whole way there. And that's attractive, you know? That's very attractive. He's working out for us. He's on leg day today. Well, we know he's been doing arm day for the past 10 years, so it's about time he did leg day, really. There we go. Oh, more wolves. I find it kind of awkward trying to do combat from horseback, so I usually just don't even bother. It's your birthday, Katie! Have birthday to you. Have birthday to you. Have birthday to you, Katie. Have birthday to you. Hope you have a good birthday. And I will set up convenient horses at some point because it is really good and it does help out a bunch. Oh, there's a cave here. What's this? A cave? Lost knife hideout. Oh. They've got some decoration near the entrance. It's not really my kind of vibes. I prefer just like a few succulents and whatnot. But they've gone for burned bodies. Okay. Hello, Uthgird. I've just remembered. I said I would update my appearance a little bit. Let's do a little show race menu moment. And okay, here's how we look currently. Oh, we were looking sad, weren't we? But I think now, now that we've got a quest ahead of us, now we know where we're going. I don't think we need to look so puzzled anymore. I think we should look... I think we should look, eh? <laughs> look at those beautiful white teeth. <laughs> What's DST? No, let's... Uh, uh, surprise? Pleasantly surprised? What about combat anger? Ooh, that is a determined face. Oh, I like that. We're going to look determined. I don't know what's happening with my eyelashes, but we're looking quite determined. Um, yeah, face sliders make me quite nervous as well. <laughs> and hair. Um, ooh, where was that? I saw a really cool ponytail then. I swear it was... <gasps> Any objections to me doing this badass hair that shows off my circulant... Circulant? <laughs> my, my circlet to its true power? I might go a bit lighter as well. Look at that. That's pretty. No objections at all. Thank you, Kira. Okay. So we're looking fierce. But also our hair is immaculate. 
So yeah, I think that's cute. Top tier hair. Okay, guys, since we're at this cave, I'm gonna go in it just to see if Caden respawns. Cause uh, if not, it's kind of awkward. There he is, there's my man. Where's Uthgard? There she is, the gang's all here. At some point, guy the way gang, we will all wear matching outfits. It's just, we've got her, right? You can get out of the way. Um, I feel like we should all be wearing matching outfits because it's very vibey to do so. Did they, did they take my bow? Oh my gosh, they took my bow. I had a really cool bow and they took it. Words can't even describe how angry I am right now. At least I still have this. Wait, do I? So what do I have? That's what I have. <laughs> okay, we got some bandits. You hear that? I'm gonna try and up my blocking skill a little bit. Nice. It's fine. We'll make that money back and and more so, you know. There we go. That is taken care of, Oofgood. Thanks so much for taking care of it. We got a cage key, a lockpick. We love a lockpick. This is was this armor? No, this armor's worse than mine. Apart from those that are better, but I'd rather have good schnicks, you know. Take those. Maybe, what could I have done about that Robin? He came in so fast. Let's get a bit of warmth. You could take Caden's bow. What do you need? Oh, do you think we should go after Grillo Grellod? If what event is said about her is really true, we should bleed her like a pig. Why are you bleeding pigs? Some of my regrets it's not very are vegan. things I didn't do. I've stood back and watched unspeakable things happen to people. Because I saw this as an opportunity to make up for some of that. Oh, kill okay. Old woman and stop those little children from being hurt. Okay, he says kill her. Um, that's cool. Um, I'm gonna take your bow though, friend. It's nothing personal. I'm just more important than you. That's all there is to it. Thanks. Um, and then oh, that's super annoying. I don't know why my menu does that. Let's favorite this and add it to the cool gang one two three four five you can be number six there we go and now i am a bow holder why caden's voice got to be so saucy though it's so like almost refreshing hearing you guys all love caden's voice because i think because my accent's northern i'm always just like oh people hate our accents but you guys you guys don't you guys be liking the accent so that's really nice to hear oh can i get him as he runs by Oh, that would have been a, that would have been cool though, right? No, nah, I'm garbage. Let's face it. There we go. Oh. Oh no, I'm becoming a stealth archer. Who could have seen this coming? Not in my sky. Oh my gosh, what is he? Did he just vomit at you? A sickly. That is disgusting. You should be ashamed of yourself. I'm gonna steal that though. He just vomited. Imagine just using vomps as like a tool to fight Let's someone with a weirdo i'm gonna take your gold and i'm gonna take these wait that i'm gonna take that book please save okay <laughs> yeah it is like um it is a bit of a zombie game mechanic that isn't it very much so Ooh, words and philosophy there we go just got a university degree there Another bow, an arrow. The bows have quite good value, so I'm going to take it. I might give it to Caden, but I actually prefer him to go, like, straight at the front and fight, you know? And the engineer, thank you so much for the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 10. A thousand bits. Thanks for being a beautiful person inside and out. You're a joy to watch. I'm glad you enjoy watching me. Yeah, let's give the other bow to Caden. Uh, that bow seemed me need me to take some things. Oh, he was complaining about his bow. Oh, <gasps> He just started talking about how I stole his bow. Yours does 34 though. Here you go. <laughs> I feel so far. <laughs> Taking his nice bow. <laughs> Caden killed the wolves with the bow. Well, you won't be doing that anymore, will he? Because they're all mine now. Oh, a trap. Watch one of these Egypts trigger it. 
Oh, well done. You avoided it. Uthgird, will you avoid it? Oh, good. Are you trying to get me killed, lady? Huh? huh? Hurt my foot. You knew what you were doing. Oh. And you got all the guards on me. I'll try and make <laughs> You knew exactly what you were doing. Wait, where did she go? Oh, jeez, you made light work of them, though. She's worse than Lydia. I was impressed by Caden, though. He went right... He went round it. How did he know to do that? You did not, did you, babes? You went straight through it, didn't you? Look at you. What can I do for you? Nothing useful, it turns out. Still, though, you remember the gang, and we protect the gang. So let's continue on. If this comes out at a different entrance and my horse is at the other one, I'm, I'm going to be so mad. Oh, there's two ways to go here. Let's check this way. <laughs> Lydia is useless, um, but she is... Um, this is all the bows in this episode. She is beautiful, though. So if you get her, if you help out... Um, what's it called? I w sorry, I wanna. Oh my gosh, you guys aren't giving me tons. Well, that's taken. Problem. Can I help you? <gasps> now you, let's move. You guys don't give me a chance to do anything. I'm like, oh, Skooma. Um, I'm like, oh, let me just figure out which one I want to use. And in that time, you guys are like, careful there, friend. <sighs> yeah, it is very legolasy. Ah, oh, my first crush. Right. Oh, okay. I wanna, uh, I wanna work on these parlors a little bit. Plus, if you successfully block, it like staggers them a bit, and then you can kind of use that. Do your work. Fall to my blade. Let it be a lesson to others. Okay, I was just enjoying, you know, enjoying my two moments there, Caden. But I guess not. Uh. <laughs> Why do you think I was so savage? It was like, eh, eh, eh. it was like, I am gonna cut your face clean in half, and then that's what exactly what he did. Ooh, ooh, I can't be wearing that. Um, that was really aggressive, Caden. Can't say I'm not into it, but it was aggressive. Uh, I think that's the whole cave. Is the cave cleared now? Um, no, it doesn't say cleared. What have we missed, Uthgard? Oh, up here, maybe? No, that's where I came from, right? Hmm. I hate when it doesn't say cleared on the map. That, for me, is intensely annoying. Here, would you like a drink, Caden? Please take this. There you go. What's the out the hurry? way, out the way was good! Oh, you're annoying me, you. I might have to blast you off a cliff. Go up. You came from below. No, this is where we came from. Look. Weird, right? Unless I can go up. Uh, maybe that's the whole thing. Free. That's fine, though, because our horses are outside. I just wanted to get warm and get some bits and bobs, you know. Do a bit of shopping. Just a little bit of shopping. Oh, how do I get over there? Hmm. It's all that bit. Sir, how did how do I get to you, sir? Maybe he'll show us the way. Do you know the way? Okay, where does he go? Oh, you don't want to tell us, do you, Doom Ranger? There was another way around. Wait, can I get up here? And then climb along? I think that's the exit, but can I cheat the system and use it as the entrance? Can I do some parkour? Parkour. I don't think I can parkour my way up. Nah. Sag. Oh well. It's fine. I don't want to lose my horse anyway. So we just came in for some little bits and bobs and then we'll be on our way. And we've not really had a chance to use our tent yet, have we? Which is the saddest point of all. Nothing worth having here, no.
Right, let's head back to... What was it called? Sigur Spirit. Little Sigur Spirit. Banana milk, thank you so much. The 300 bits. Uthgird is such a mood. I, I take the make out of her, but I do love her. <laughs> and Jake Fakers, thank you so much. The three months in a row. Nicole Leo, thank you so much. The seven months in a row. And Weaver Stories, thank you so much for gifting two subs. If you are gifted by Weaver Stories, please make sure you say thank you in the chat. I'm so good that Caden doesn't get a horse. I don't know why. There's there's no reason for him to not have a horse. Uh, I'm trying to work out how to harvest ingredients while on horseback. The game seems to think I should be able to do it, but I know not how. Come on. Oh my gosh, these wolves. Come on, says Caden. Are we hungry? Gosh. How am I always hungry? Oh, I just stand on top of the ingredients. Okay. Let's have some grilled leeks and... No more raw stuff. For the love of God, please don't give me any more raw stuff. There we go. I am well fed. Oh, off we go. So many wolves here. We just want to get up the mountain. In peace. Do we have any more cabages? Um, we are out of cabages right now. Incredibly sad news, I know. I'm um, sorry, I can't see a damn thing here. Oh my gosh, Caden, come we'll sort out wish. these. Come sort these out for us, babes. Go on. There you go, Caden. Go on, get it, Caden. But he won't he won't help Uthgard. He's like, I literally don't care whether she lives or dies. No, he will. Okay. Can I harvest things from like this? It's been a while since I've used convenient horses. I'm just trying to like relearn it all. Right, and then here's what you do with horses on Skyrim. You kind of just use them to glitch your way up mountains. That's kind of a big part of Skyrim. Is glitching your way up a mountain. Some mountains do it, some mountains don't, but. This is basically 90% of Skyrim. If you're not doing this, you're not really playing Skyrim. There you go. Glitching your way up the mountain. This is probably... <laughs> My horse is flying. <laughs> it's probably not even a good use of your time because then you look to the side and there was a path you could have gone on. But I can't resist the urge every single time. I just... I gotta do it. There's something about it that just... I want to just glitch my way up a mountain. Go on, little horsey. The horses of Skyrim are known for their strength at going on vertical. They are trained for this since birth, more or less. Foals come out horizontal and immediately they can stand sideways. It, it is known. It's like a very famous thing about Skyrim horses that they are actually goats. Look at that, see? If you do this enough, usually you can get up. You've got to move your camera angle around. Yep, there you go. Up I go. Oh my gosh, I'm on a vertical right now. It's a beautiful thing to behold. No other horse in any other game can do this. Horses in Red Dead, they can't do this. This is a Skyrim exclusive feature. You know, only a Skyrim horse can go vertical. Look, look, do you see it glide up the hill there? It glided up the cliff like an angel. It's, it's like an angel, really. There you go. So, all in all, I glitched up a cliff in five minutes that I could have gone on a path on two minutes for. But where would the fun have been in that? You know? Beautiful workhorse. Well done, Sigur Spirit. You've made horses across the land proud there. Now you got stuck in a tree. Right, F5 that. <laughs> off we go sometimes my um because i've got you see my viewfinder is like really um is it six that my bow's on i have to like make it look in the distance and then reclose my bow in order to build no see all all my oh was this all my view is focusing on is like also blurry um what's this what's going on here then 
Oh, very suspicious. Hmm. Wait, where's my horse just go? It's probably nothing. Let's continue, Sigur. <laughs> Spirit out here hustling. Banana milk, thank you so much for the one, two, three gifted subs. If you're gifted by banana milk, please make sure you say a big thank you in the chat. Right, guys, I will get us to Helgen. I know I keep getting distracted by foolishness, but it, it's going to be fine. We're going to get to Helgen. Um, it's... Oh, it's the, it's the opposite direction. Let us continue on. Bravely. And vertically. Okay, I can't climb a mark. I can't climb a waterfall. That is not something I can do. Can I survive a drop from a waterfall? Look at that. Gorgeous. Look how pretty this game is. Why go in Mark Zuckerberg's metaverse when you could just go in Skyrim? Oh my gosh, am I going to have to use a, a pass through the caves? Is there a cave here? This is a nightmare. I'm at the bottom of a valley. What's through here? Nothing. Nothing! Let's ride, Sigur. And I'm gonna have to go back on myself a little bit, aren't I? Oh my gosh, I can't see a thing! I hate riding by nightfall. We've gotta get our skates on, gang. Oh, no thanks. I am not uh, I'm not ready for you, friend. I wish no fights. I will continue up this path. It's so pretty, right? And I've got like my little um look, my little torch out. And it's so pretty riding at this time with your torch. That was a troll. Um ignore the troll. We're not we're not we're not fighting the troll. We we are here in with peace and love. Oh. Not today. I'm just not ready to make well, Okay. We're at Iverstead. This is perfect. This is perfect. This means we're near Riften. I think. And the air is comfy here. We have comfy air. Yeah, this is perfect. This is the right path. This is the right path. Okay, this should say Helgen. No, it does not. We'll we'll trust it anyway. We'll trust it anyway. Uthgird, where's your horse, you fool? She's lost a horse. Even the horse don't trust her. The trolls aren't the prettiest. To be fair, they're not. Eh? This this way. They're not really known for beauty trolls, are they? You know, like, oh, what a beautiful troll. What a gorgeous troll. I'm gonna simp for that troll. And I miss Caden, so I'm just going to do this cave just so we see cute Caden. Although it might... This isn't the one with the scary witches, is it? Oh! <laughs> My blade is thirsty for blood. daily power um is it said okay now i'm on fire at least i feel like that's a good thing being on fire you know oh caden caden with the language caden with the language My fires do nothing! <laughs> Kaden, get him! Get him, Kaden! No, stop bringing up the steam menu! That is such an annoying thing! Okay, let me... <laughs> um, I'm gonna just heal a bit. 
Um, can I get... Did I sell my regenerate magic? Didn't I have a whole thing about how I couldn't be bothered to regenerate magic? Guess what I need right now. <laughs> I need magic! Get him! Get him, guys! Wait, don't go for me! Go for Kaden! Look how much more threatening he is! Kaden! Kaden, where are you? Oh no, where is he going? Oh my gosh, if it brings up the Steam menu once more, I'm suing. Why does it keep bringing up the Steam menu? <laughs> of course I'm using Caden as bait. Have you seen the guy? He's freaking huge. Do I have any other cool powers? Oh, I could harvest some wood. Summon Caden. Um, I don't have enough power for that yet, do I? I can't use wolf pack. Oh my gosh. Wait, how do- Oh, it's dead. Right. Wait, why am I walking? You have to run, you Ouija! Run! Run like there's no tomorrow. He's killed one of them. Oh gosh. Me versus there is not ideal. You redeemed a Porsche check, Carlo. It was at this moment I realized I'd messed up. I literally have. I need to, you know what I need to do? I need to save it once I set my power on because I'm driving myself mad with that. The thing is, I believe somehow that we can do this. If I just get behind Caden, maybe. Oh, wrong one. We go for the best one on we go for one bear at a time. We might be okay. You know? If we just focus bear by bear, I th I think we can do it. That's the thing. I feel like we could do it. As long as the bears don't focus on me, we're fine. Oh my gosh, the bears are focusing on me. The bears have turned their eyes to me. <laughs> Once Caden's down, <laughs> run like an Egypt. Will the bears come out? Wait, I can let them heal and then we can go back in. Oh, the bears have come out. Okay, two down, guys, two down. There's only one more bear to go. Where is the final bear? Wait, did we get them all? Oh, we went back to sleep? Well, that was a foolish idea. Oh, sorry, guys. Keep doing that. Oh, I set my bird on fire. Not good. I see, I knew we could do it. Charlotte thinks the eight months. I knew we had it in us, guys. I knew we had it in us. That's why I kept pushing it. Um, I just, I felt it in me water. I thought we could do it. I felt like we had the potential and the, and we had the power and i was right because look at us go look at that wait my these fur shoes are better than what trash shoes have i got on i don't even know but well done guys we did it skyrim is a lot scarier in first person i've never played it in third person oh <gasps> i could have created a volcano eruption oh that would have been so cool what a way to kill all the bears um I was just not expecting to go into the cave and there'd be a bear straight there. I kind of thought it was the witchy cave. Be cautious. Beasts are... <laughs> that was funny though. Can I, can I get this bear? No, the bear fell too far in. Okay, where did my horse go? Question mark. Horse? Oh, is that honey? Where's my horse? Mind Oth yourself. Oh, good. What have you done with my horse? Did the bear scare the horse away? Have I got summon horse? How come I can summon Caden, but I can't summon a horse? Oh man, I think the horse got scared by the bears. Oh man. Wait, is this back to Ivor's head? Wait, where's Helgen? 
I'm so close, but now I'm confused. I think I've got to go around the back of the cave and go through like this pass here. Sigur is gone. Yeah. I think so. Oh, that's super frustrating. I think the bear scared it away. Horses to the right of the cave. Did I just miss it? I'm squinting because I can't see. Horsey! Mr. Horsey! Donde esta? Odio! Vobisu! I don't know where it's gone. <gasps> you beautiful creature! Sigur spirit, we are back! Let's ride into the night. We got Sigur, guys. All is saved. I can't see a thing. But all is saved. Okay, right. I'm gonna have to rely quite heavily on my map reading skills here. Um, I have none. But I will try. My very hardest. Ooh, look at us. Oh, yay! I've completed all my ingredient harvesting. Check me out. Right. Perform a fast dismount. Friend, I, if I get off my horse now, I'm not going to be able to find my horse again. That is going to be game over. Have you seen how dark it is? I'm going to follow the northern lights. Ooh. An alchemist shack. Oh, I'm an alchemist. I'll take this. This is mine now. Look at the shack. The shack is mine. I'm going to have a butterfly in a jar. Oh, this is a great harvest. Don't know whose it is, but they're not here. And finders keepers, losers reefers. What time we are? Oh, and I've got a bed to stay for the night. Let me read this little journal. Coming to this area was a brilliant decision. The local flora seems to have many useful properties. La -di -da -di -da. I've moved my alchemy work outside the shed. The midday air is a boon to my health, as well as my inspiration to my work. Oh, is that it? What happened to them? It's all very sus. Oh, look, a plate. I got thrown in jail for less than stealing a plate. I don't know whose this shack is, but it's mine now. Um, let's use it. Wait, what did you guys say? Met an alchemist in Cyrodiil who told me the keyest ingredients to find out what they do. Bugger that. I'm not... <laughs> They're all eating spiders eggs. To... <laughs> Bugger that. That's what Cadence thoughts on, um... Cadence thoughts on eating random things. Bugger that. <laughs> it actually sounds the same when I say it. And we've increased our alchemy. Yay! We can level up, which is perfect because I have a bed to level up in. So, wait, didn't I say I have to do stamina next? I have to do stamina next because I accidentally clicked magicka last time. So we're going to do stamina. But which tree level up next? Magicka, fightings... Armorins and stuff. Sneakins. Um, and what's the other one? Magic and fighting, armorin, sneaking. I think that's the four, right? Okay, go ahead and vote now, chat. Can I get a house? I can do it, but it's a very long process. Um, building a house in this game is not as easy as it is in Sims. You have to literally cut down trees. And like find clay deposits. And yeah, it's a lot. It's an awful lot. But it's worth it because the house is really I'm cute. Fascinated how you oh, to was it health? It was health. Thank you guys. What would I do without you? Because I can't remember anything. <laughs> okay, health. Right. I'm going to rest for the night because honestly, I don't like traveling in darkness. Not about that life. But... I want my gang to feel respected and like I love them and I want to sit around a campfire with them. So I'm going to see if I can do a campfire. Yeah, let's do a little, little campfire for the lads. Um, there we go. Place a little campfire for the lads. And then... Wait, can I not? Where's the fire? <laughs> Where's the... I want to I want to properly build a campfire. Did I do did I can I reset the campfire settings? 
Because I think I did it wrong. Oh no, not Bethesda mods, lol. Um, campfire. No, let's do realistic. There we go. Because I want to actually build a campfire, you know? All right, let's try this again. Build a little campfire for the lads. And then... Wait, I need to like... What's going on? Usually it tells you you've got to collect fire and stuff. Uh, collect wood. Yes! Okay, there we go. Right. Kindling. Let's build a fire. Nice. Put some little wood shavings on it. Add to the fire. And now we can... Oh, I've made it way more awkward. Okay. <laughs> I actually made it harder. You can't see my character, but I'm making a little fire in the rain. Wait, I'm is this the, here. is this the fire? Are you joking me, game? What, what is my character? Do oh, okay, I, this is too realistic for me. <laughs> this is far too realistic for me. <laughs> Let's do quick, <laughs> quick. There we go. <laughs> I can't be watching this. Well, I'm just stuck here now. Oh, Uthgard can give me gifts. Her regard for me has increased. Are you making a fire? This is the slowest fire I've ever seen. What you need is my grandma Bridie in Ireland. She can get a fire going in no time at all. Literally, I've never seen anyone get a fire going. She'll put plastic in it and she will like literally kill you with chemicals and fumes. But she'll get a fire going, you know? Um... I need to, I need to harvest some wood. Let us go gathering some branches and dead wood together, guys. Okay, let's gather some branches. Sometimes your followers can get extra pieces of wood for you as well. You find five branches. Caden found a branch. Oh, Uthgard. Uthgard, babes. You're walking over there because you didn't find a branch. I think that's what happened. Um, let's... Add a bit more to the campfire. There we go. Now I can cook my raw meat. Which is going to stop me constantly eating raw meat. Which can only be a good thing. Okay, there we go. Nice little roaring fire. And you can use skills from this as well that make you better at surviving the cold. So. Oh, um, Firecraft makes me... Oh, I can't use any of them yet because it's my, only my first time doing it, but you can do. Pretty cool, right? That's a mod. Okay. Um, wait. Don't I touch a little butterfly to make it go away? There we go. What Bye, skills. I so, I think if I sit around the fire, my followers will, like, come and sit with me. <laughs> and then we just talk about the day, which is nice. Like, so how did you find today? You know, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna have a bit to eat. I'm just gonna have a little... Little mum of steak while I'm here. A few titties. How did you find today, Caden? Let's, uh, any, any thoughts? Hmm. Nothing important. Okay, I thought we'd have a little chit-chat. Why, why don't... Didn't you want to join the companions? It's not for me. Oh, okay. It's not just the companions. Jenny Stonecloud, thank you so much for 15 months in a row. I'm glad you're enjoying so watching this play. Rubicon, thank you so much for 17 no, months in a row. Idea. Charlotte, thank you so much for the eight months in a row. And Locatato, thank you so much for the two months in a row, four months in total. I have some lore for the reason Windhelm has such a large population of dark elves compared to every other hold. Oh, please tell. Because we were discussing last time that it's because it's the first place you come from the Somerset Isles. Is that correct? Um. Okay, so he doesn't want to join the companions. I'm going to let these guys hang. Um, I'm going to be like, let's rest here. This is how this is how overly much I like to like. Aye, we ought to make camp. Yeah, yeah. You make a camp. You guys do whatever you need to do. Uh, you sit around the fire. Nice. You keep watch. I'm gonna sleep. And what was the results of the poll mods? Because I'm not gonna lie, I kind of forgot that we did one. And there was a light change. What was the light change? Armor. Oh, you little cheekies! You voted for armor. Okay, so you guys said health, so I'm going to add to my health. And then for armor, I'm going to include a few bits in here that aren't strictly armor, but they're all in, like, the same vibes. So, I am going to pull you guys for if you want. 
What now? Uh, enchanting, smithing, heavy armor, light armor, or blocking. Because I feel like they're all similar vibes, you know? They're not fighting. They're a bit different. Different kind of thing. Uh, and we've got a lilac or any color of your choice. Now, I think we already have lilac in the background. So what I'm going to do instead, I can do two lights as different things. I'm, oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do keep one on lilac. And then you guys said to any color of your choice. So I'm going to go for green. For the forests of Skyrim. Oh, the pink one was earlier. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. There we go. And I sure wish I had some peach juice right now. Mm -mm. okay what are we gonna be doing enchanting is useful it's re enchanting basically lets you apply um magic to weapons smithing lets us make better stuff every time we get to a smithing area heavy armor we're not currently using and honestly if we're going for the mage build it makes no sense whatsoever blocking as you can imagine like this 200 we're not current oh 200 is different don't worry about that and light armor is over here. Okay. I'm glad you guys said light armor because that makes sense for the build that we're going with, which is kind of like a fighting mage type thing. We've got to start at the bottom. So I'm going to do the first one. But we can go... The top of this is like 20% movement speed, which is kind of cool because we can get out of the way because we're speedy. Uh, less, less blocks from... Less damage from blocked attacks. War Dancer improves elemental shocks. That's going to be so useful to us because we're a mage. While sprinting, you take less damage from attacks. That's good as well. We've got some breaking waves. Unarmed attacks. We're not really using unarmed, so not really useful. But I think this one, that is going to make us god tier if we can get all the way to that. So that's like the War Dancer branch. And a War Dancer? No, yeah, yeah. It's like War Dancer. So very cool and we've slept for the night let's face it we're probably starving so i'm gonna have a bit of potato soup oh, poor rabbit i'm gonna eat 20 apples just all in one go no i'm not i'm gonna save a few for next time how was your sleep caden yes. any need. come on let's get going guess we better get going we mess we best yep we... <laughs> he's you? making me go really yorkshire oh, oh no 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 you've not earned it. it you've not done a thing I'm, i lie you're not resting something on your mind let's go guess we better get going i and let's destroy this so nobody knows where we were here so it's always sensible and caden i'm assuming you've what looked after my horse all night you have you little angel you and let's ride sigur i wonder if we should get some shelter Press E twi twice. Oh. Oh, that's so helpful. I can do fast dismounts now. Practice a horse whistle. Stand where Sigga can see you. Okay. <laughs> that's me actually whistling, though. Oh. We're getting attacked by something, and I'm just like, is that another bear? Oh no, it was a wolf. Wolf, how dare you attack me when I'm practicing my horse whistling? Um, okay, stick a spirit. I'm doing a wolf whistle. Oh, that's so helpful! I can summon my horse now. Wait, why are you running away? Come back here. Come on, Sigga, to follow. Okay. Follow me. Let's go this way. Okay, this horse is confused. And I can now get traveling equipment. <gasps> okay, next time we go to somewhere um, which has stables, I can get like little backpacks for my horse and stuff. It's going to look so cute. It's good. Have you got your horse, babes? Yep, yours is over there. Caden, it's leg day today as well. Well, I've got to admire the commitment. And let's continue our journey to Helgen, which has taken us 12 and a half years. Yeah, the woods are so pretty. I have a mod. Probably the best mod for Skyrim. It's just called Simply Bigger Trees. And after you've had it, you will never... Why is there so many dead goats here? Um, you will never be able to not have it. Because it's such a simple mod that makes the game so much better. Genuinely. I don't know how anyone plays it without Simply Bigger Trees. Because the trees in Skyrim, they're simply too small. Where is Helgen? Okay, I'm facing the right direction now. 
Gosh, I'm, these these paths are quite confusing. I'm gonna go this way instead. Posh to check, thank you. Yeah, so if you've got Skyrim, I fully recommend you down simply bigger trees. And once you've had it, you'll be like, how do I ever have any how would I ever not have it? There's also a mod that adds like trees, like fallen trees on on strict Oh my gosh. Caden babes, small job for you. We seem to have a snow bear in our mist. If you hurt Sigur, I swear to God. Snow bear. Well, at least we know why there were so many dead sheep now. Off we go. We're just going to leave this one. Just do a little yo out of here. <laughs> trees. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, the trees in cities mod. See, I run JK Skyrim. Um, apart from Riften, I don't use JK's Riften. I use something else. And that adds a bunch of trees as well. And yeah, it does make it so much better. I'm trying to get down here without hurting my horse. Which is easier said than done. Okay. How are we looking? How are we looking on the route to Helgen? We're nearly there. Wait, have I... <gasps> okay, this is a great opportunity, gang. Let's just do a cheeky F5 because... When the storm guards and uh, sorry, the storm cloaks and the imperials fight each other, the legions always looking for strong. The imperials won this one, right? You Who's this guy? You... What are the Thalmor doing here? You, citizen. Oh, this is a Thalmor. I am a Thalmor Judicia on important business that you are interfering with. What are you doing in Skyrim? We're making sure your emperor wasn't lying to his elven masters when he agreed the empire would give up false gods and foolish beliefs. Elven now, masters. Go away. Right. Wait until we're out of sight of the guards and then... I hate them. I hate them so much, but this is an absolutely great opportunity to nab some bits and bobs from folks. Right, the Stone Cloaks and the Imperials will sometimes just have fights. So it looks like a lot. Uh, the Imperial. The Stone the Guards lost this. Get. But. Look at this. Shoulder pad. I'll take that. I will take that, sir. Um, helmet. Armor. It it's just a good opportunity to rob people. And you know, I'm always going to take Skyrim. that opportunity, you know? Can't wait to kill another of Ulfric's boys. Right, hopefully the Thalmor are going up the hill. Oh my gosh, yes, they're going the same way as us. Okay, guys, just a little little quick poll. What shall we do about the Thalmor? Do we kill them or not kill them? Your guys' decision. Sar63, thank you so much for subscribing with your prime. Can we welcome Sar to the features, please? And Sontu, thank you so much for the bits. I've been a fan since Rags to Riches on Willow. Oh, you've got an interview today. Can we get some good look uh, good luck for Son in their interview today? I hope it goes amazing. And hey, Shoyo Queen, thank you for the bits. I'm totally invested in Caden. I wonder if you can marry in Skyrim. You can. You can marry Caden. He'll probably get some different dialogue when we marry him as well. So, yeah. It is definitely a thing we can do. Don't worry. Right. The Thalmor are going up the hill. Hi, guys. We're not getting involved in your war. We're just passes by. Just passes by doing our thing. Don't worry about us. Okay, bye. 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 Time for the Thalmor. Right, what are you guys suggesting? They might be quite strong, but giving up an opportunity to kill the Thalmor is giving an opportunity to live, you know? I am very cold though. So we kill and then we immediately get inside and start a campfire. 82% kill them. Right, F5. My blade is thirsty for blood. His blade is thirsty for blood, guys. Yes! Get him! Fight, coward! Fight, coward! Oh my gosh, they're making light work of them. Last witness killed. We don't even have a bounty for it. We killed you for free. We killed you for free. I'm stealing everything from you. You deserve nothing. Your bodies deserve to die in the cold. Actually, oh, I'll take those. Uh, they're not as good. You hateful, hateful beings. We hate the Thalmor. Where did the other guy go? Oh, here he is. 
The Just a Car. It's a shame because their armor's actually kind of sick, but they are also sick in the head, so no thanks. It was suspiciously easy, but we've got Caden on our side, so I I'm going to go seek warmth in this coven. I'm sure there's nothing scary or dangerous in here, right? Let's seek some warmth, gang. <gasps> Vampires! Vampalaroonies! Up there. It's his imagination. Why are the Thalmor bad? So the Thalmor are like almost this sect that gets to do whatever they want on behalf of the Empire. That's taken care of. And um Don't let any they're just horrible. And they're so rude to you and they're just evil, so we don't like them. Um They can infect you with that curse. Yeah, don't let vampires touch you. Good thoughts from Caden there. And I was hoping we might start warming up a bit in here, but it's kind of not been happening yet, has it? You feel warmer, but still chilly. Okay, at least I can heal a bit more. We should collect the dust from the vampire corpses. Agree. Can be used in portions to cure <gasps> diseases. Oh! Ironic. Ah! Let me out the way! I don't want to become a vampire. Not that would bad. be terrible. Not bad. Nice. Well done. Vampire fledgling. Oh, your arm is so cool. It's very cool. Yeah, the Thalmor think that the elves are superior. They said your elven masters. Um, they're just horrible. The elves in this, not all elves, but certain high elves in particular, have a little bit of like a superiority complex. So, and then the Thalmor are the ones that basically, um, like act on that sort of thing. Oh, well done, Katie boy. Look at me just leaving them to do all the work and I'm just down here like, pew, pew, pew. Oh, geez. Well done. Yeah, FOMO is just kind of... They're kind of rude boys. Kind of rude boys. We don't like them. Uh, take the dust, though, because the dust is useful. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. I guess so. Oh, yeah! Alchemy lab time. Let's just say there's a reason why they're called high elves. Yeah, exactly. But not all high elves think like that. You know? Just some. Yeah, I like just shooting arrows from the sidelines while the protectors handle everything. It's just, it's just cozier for me, you know? Why put myself in danger, you know? There's no reason for it. And I'm now warm. Okay, awesome. Uh, and we've got a light change to pink. Okay. Let's do some pink lights. Pink is like here. Pretty, right? How are we doing for time? Oh my gosh, it's taking me so long this journey to Hulgan. Because I keep just getting <laughs> distracted by life. Plus we had that whole death situation, which was awkward. Ooh, I need a woodcutter's axe for my campfire, don't I? I'm the support team. Well, I'm like, you know, you never put the king right at the front. Well, you do, to be fair. But I think putting the king right at the front is kind of foolish. If you go into battle. So I think it makes more sense to have the king, like, not on the front line. Just safer, you know? Get ready. Trouble ahead. Hello? Who's there? Okay, I, I handled that one. You two handle the rest. Go on. No? What are you doing, Caden? <laughs> Where did he go? <laughs> He's a bit confused, isn't he? Wait, what is that? Oh! <gasps> <laughs> Why was the mannequin coming to get me? That man had no head. We sure showed them, eh? We sure showed them. We did. Um. What can I do for you, friend? What was that? That is coming for me in my nightmares tonight. A million percent. That was literally horrifying. What's the Nether Rift? That sounds cool. 
What was that? <laughs> That's why this game is so great, because nonsense happens all the time, and I am there for it every time. It's part of the charm, you know? Who wants a game that works? That's what I say. Be suspicious of people who want games that work. Embrace those who want just crazy games like this. It's way more fun. Ooh, so the vampires came in and killed these bandits. Interesting. And ooh, any, ooh, a little destruction book. Just a naked headless man. Yeah, just coming towards you slowly, but you know, what's the word I'm thinking of where you don't stop continuously, effortlessly? No, like slowly, but like forever, you know? He will just always be chasing you. I can't think of the word that I mean. Slowly but infinitely. I don't know. Slowly but surely. <laughs> that works too. Slowly but eternally. I like that. Relentlessly. I like that too. Yeah, that's kind of what he was doing, right? Okay. It's my time to shine. Shiny. I love lockpicking. I wish I knew how to lockpick in real life because if I'm this good at, at it in Skyrim, I'll probably be amazing in real life, right? That's how things tend to go, right? Little vampire beds. Little vampire cage. Can we get down? No. Almost this game is just cut and jump long ways very well. Oh, should I try that new spell I got, by the way? What kind of magic was it? Nether Rift. Places a magical trap at the target location. For 15 seconds afterwards, the enemy will be teleported into the trap's initial position. <laughs> what kind of big brain spell is that? Do you think I'm going to know how to use that? What a lot of nonsense. I won't understand that. Tips for lock clicking. Uh, next time I do a lockpick, I will show you my technique of how I do it. Oh no. Arachno. Uh, uh, spider fetish warning. Victory. Caden, yeah. you get stronger every day. Literally, look at you go. It's a joy to watch. It truly is. <laughs> you know, arachnophobia, the. Also known as spider fish. Is that not what it's called? <laughs> spider what now? <laughs> I'm gonna destroy these, I'm afraid. Oh, I now have no feet. That was a foolish, Crafting. foolish decision. And we've leveled up again. Check us out. What absolute legends. Okay. I know it's phobia. It's a joke from the last time we played. What to level next? Health, stamina, or magicka? Let me know what you guys are thinking. Taylor 2 b thank you so much for the one, two, three, four, five, six hundred bits. I'm so glad you're enjoying the stream so much. Thank you so much for the bits, my love. And Odise, thank you so much for the 11 months in a row. You're previously Rosy Petals. Hello, Odd Eyes. I like the new name and I like the old name. They're both cool. Okay, yeah, Mo <laughs> also Mod had a moment there, didn't it? Oh my gosh, I'm getting so much cool stuff from in here and it's not even robbed, so they can't use it against me. Like they Let's always do. Okay. Someone there? Oh, who said that? Oh! Come on, Hi, sir. Come on. That mod is... Well, that's taking Kill Oathgird! That mod is kind of like... um, That spell's sort of like fighting with portals, isn't it? That's the vibe I'm getting from it. Now you're thinking with portals. Okay, let's do a bit of snack in here. There? God, you've got good eyes. Don't see that at all. <gasps> no! Please don't say I've contracted vampireitis. That was a bit awkward for you, Uthgird, because I shot them as you went for a big hit and then it just looked like you were hitting thin air and <laughs> I was a bit awkward for you. It's a bit embarrassing. 
I won't bring it up again, but I was embarrassed and I was embarrassed for you. Caden, were you embarrassed? Yeah, Caden was embarrassed too. <gasps> Awkward for you. <gasps> oh, we are meant to bring a dog here. So there's a talking dog in this game called Barbus, I think. And you've got to bring him here. It'd be really easy when we need to bring him here because everyone's already dead. Um, and he gets reunited with his owner. That's the Daedric Prince, in fact. That is Daedric Prince right there, I think. Which apparently we are known for loving, so I'm just going to embrace them and love them. Oh, look at this cool thing. Whoa. I'll take them all. Some apples there, but I'll leave the apples and then... Yeah, the talking dog... The dogs in this game sound great until... Um you realize they're actually quite annoying because they just never stop barking and it does my head in so just saying they're not quite as cool as they sound because they oh safe yeah they never stop barking they're just like ruff 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 all the freaking time and it does my head in kira welcome on in i'm sorry you didn't get the um oh should i try and whistle for my horse i don't think it's gonna be able to see me oh <gasps> baby hello Oh my gosh, Spirit is the best horse ever. I'm going to be so sad when I kill it in five minutes time. How good is this horse? How much of an absolute legend is my horse? Okay, we need to go left. This way. Is that right? Yeah. When I'm chilly. Bit chilly. Literally. No, the horses don't need to eat and sleep. What I do if I'm role playing is when I get to like a big city, I'll put my horse in the stables and like get it to wait there so that someone's taking care of it. Um, but you don't actually need to do that. You just do that if you're a tryhard like me. Oh yeah. Let's head on to Helgen. And once we've done this, we will start seeing dragons in Skyrim. Oh, it was. Clavicus Vile is the Daedric Prince of Bargain. Was that Clavicus? It looked like it from the start. It looked like a Daedric Prince from the statue, but I had no idea. I'm not very, uh, I'm not very good on my Skyrim lore. Thank you so much for two months in a row, Anna. Your name, whenever I see your name, just because of, like, whenever I see the name Kathleen, I always want to say Kathleen. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Got. Oh wow, the mist. Holy smokes! Is that a dragon? No way! So yeah, that's a dragon. And here we are in Helgen. I think we can find some fiery remains here that tell us, yeah, we're gonna start seeing dragons. And fun story, when we kill a dragon, we can absorb its soul. Because we're kind of special. Maybe they got rid of the thing to find on the floor. Yeah, there's usually like a little burned, a charred body. And if you find the charred body, it has like a note on it about what happened here. And then that completes live another life. I don't know where the charred body is. Any little smoky bodies? Smoky bodies. We oh, yeah, got little smoky bodies. Oh, maybe in here. Little Kentucky Fried body. No, not there. Any Kentucky Fried bodies. Hmm. I can't seem to find it. Put your weapons away, you fools. Horse, don't block me. Thanks, babes. It says it's like right here somewhere. Oh, that's her horse! Wow, she totally copied me. Same color and everything, but okay. Oh, it's there. It was right in front of me. The body turns to ash as you touch it, but a leather journal survived the attack. So let's go check out the journal. And okay, hard to believe I filled up this whole journal already. I received word from my contacts in Skyrim. All seems quiet. So much for being the street. I'd cross the border. <laughs> They're searching for somebody important. I woke this morning with an imperial sword pressed to my neck. Oh no. Um, on the fifth entry, if only I'd known sooner, the ambush. I'm in a cart with me. I'm stone cloaked rebels. No way. Ah. And then I still can't believe it. A dragon straight from the legends. Nobody back home will ever believe me. And yeah, that's what happened. So that's what happened in Helgen's. Live another life, I think, is complete now. I think so, anyway. 
Um... Oh! Investigate the cave mentioned in the journal or warn the residents of Riverwood about the attack. Which would you guys rather do? Either of them completes live another life? We kind of... Riverhood's kind of a vibe, so I'd personally prefer to go there, but I'm easy. Where next? Do we investigate the cave? Or... Quickly, let's go warn the Riverwood residents about the fact that a dragon is flying straight to them. And a cackling. Thank you so much for the two months. That's that's why the cackling story was coming about. Whatever you guys want to do is what we shall do. I need to make sure I get on my right horse. Look look how she copied my horse. Look, she even bought the same bug pack as me. What can I do for you? You are such a fun. I love it. She's like, oh no, she discovered my secret. <laughs> Let's ride, spirit. The cave has some NPCs you can get some free stuff from. Like some bodies and stuff. I think it does. Is she gonna get on her horse? Yeah. I still why doesn't Caden have a horse? It's so awkward with him just walking. It's like, hello, Caden, awkward. Hashtag awkward. Make me feel bad. Like I'm a bad Caden owner, because you don't have a horse. Ooh, awkward. Gates opening towards me. Okay, what do you guys say next? Go warn Riverwood. Okay, let's do it. Let's set our next destination as... Wait, where's Riverwood? Um... Where is Riverwood? I think it's this way. I think it's just down this path. I think so? Oh, I have to buy a horse for Caden. How do I do that? Oh, thank you, hero. Yeah, we'll follow this route. I'm excited for our first dragon attack. Look at this cool place across. I'm sure we'll head there at some point. Oh. Hello. You a hunter? Oh! oh my gosh, I didn't mean to do that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, I didn't mean I meant to speak to you, but What? Oh no. I've started something that I can't stop. I killed a dog! What is it? Oh no! I just saw some dog meat. I meant to say hello and trade, but instead I just punch them. Do you ever accidentally just punch someone? It's so awkward when you do it. Okay. I guess I have to rob you now. It's just a waste to leave all the stuff out, you know? Wait, I want a fur mantle. I'm going to wear that. You have some cool stuff as well. I love the Forsworn armor. It's just really cool, but I'm so sorry. Am I still in my feet? No, I got shoeies on. But look, it was worth it because now I have a cool fur mantle. Don't wear fur in real life. It's gross. But if you're in Skyrim, you're allowed to wear fur. Everyone agrees. But not in real life. It's gross. But there, look at my cool fur mantle. So, yeah, I feel awful about the dog. I feel awful about the dog. Gosh. <laughs> uh, about 5 p.m today finn about 5 p.m okay i really want to get hecade in a horse that is like the thing we've got to focus on okay oh no anyway to be fair i wouldn't have been able to buy all that stuff from him i don't think i'd have been able to afford it so really it was actually a money saving strut money saving strut guys that's why we did it it was the most cost-effective tactic. You guys like Fendel? Is it Fe No, there is an elf in this game that I've tried so hard to make attractive. But it's not Fendel. I think it's somebody on the Somerset Isle. Not Somerset Isle. The, the Isle with all the ash. I don't know what Fendel looks like in my game, though. Wait, aren't we meant to pass stones on the way to this? How did I miss the stones? Wait, where have I gone? This ain't right. Or is it? No, it is. Where are the stones then? <laughs> One minute, Lou Brush wants to get out. <laughs> See, this is a nice little town, right? Cute vibes. 
Hamilton Maple Love, thank you so much for 15 months in a row. Take some time to focus on your mental health and well being, Peaches. I love that I've advised Camilla Turn. And Banana Milk with the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten gifted subs. Thank you so, so much um, for the ten gifted subs. If you're gifted by Banana Milk, please make sure you say a big thank you in the chat. Okay, I came in through the wrong entrance. Obviously, I did. Okay. <gasps> oh, Jesus, Andrew. Oh, you scared the life out of me, boys. A dragon. I, saw a dragon. I know, I'll warn you about the dragon in a second. I've just got to go get my stones. I need my stones, okay? Because you guys have got to vote on which stone as well. I think they're just up here. Oh, that scared me. It went right through my soul, though. What is our character's name, Viridian? Our character is called Aurora. Wait, what is that thing up there? Is that a dog? Wait, what is getting chased there? I will destroy what is that? You have a death wish? An alpha wolf? Victory or uh, what the hell is an alpha wolf? I ain't never seen no alpha wolf before. You don't know who you're messing with. Alpha wolf. Oh, it, it's down there. I can't shoot it though. My angle's wrong. Alpha wolf. You've been listening to too many podcasts, haven't you? Come on. Now who's alpha? Little beta wolf. I'll take that. <laughs> It's like the leader of the pack. Yeah, but I swear I've never seen one in Skyrim before. I didn't even know that was a thing. I've never seen that. Uh, where is call my horse scene? Hey, horse scene. Come on. Oh, it's there. Wow, well, I'm lazy. <laughs> I am the alpha now. Look at look look at me. I am the alpha now. I am the Alpha Elf. Al alpha Elf. Skyrim Clara Savage. <laughs> okay, on, on, onwards to the stones. I think they're this way. Can you have um, pets in this game? Yeah, I think you can have a dog. They're quite annoying though. They make a lot of noise. I, I usually just make mine stay at the house. Okay, up here maybe. How did I get a horse? I just bought one from outside of Windhelm. <gasps> I know the wolf wants Come to go. On. Come on, wolf. Oh my gosh. Am I just missing it at every turn? What kind of matrix, wolf? There you go. Right up your butt, wolf. Right past Caden's hair there. Right. Okay, guys. We have three stones. What is my horse doing? I don't know. But we have the thief stone, which will make our stealth skills learn... 20% faster. We have the mage stone, which will make our magic skills learn 20% faster. Or we have the warrior stone, which means combat skills are 20% faster. This is an important decision until I find a new stone and then it's an irrelevant decision. So it's kind of like, it's like GCSEs. Um, so which one to pick? Mage, thief, or warrior? I'll let you guys choose. Um, Anna, I got your two most in Anna Kathleen. Um, you can tell I just love saying your name. Clementine Crush, thank you so much for the 16 months in a row. Hope you've had a good 16 months. When we get into Riverdale, I'm going to get a little place to um, rest my head. And then after that, I will be able to level up as well. So mods, mentally, please remember what the result of the poll was because I didn't look. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> you don't have any peach points. Don't worry. You, you gain, gain peach points just from hanging out. Can I help you? Did I say Riverdale? <laughs> Riverwood. <laughs> Let's get going. It's Riverdale from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Wait, not Riverdale. Is that the TV show? Is that... <laughs> What am I even talking about? We definitely don't want to go to Riverdale. Magestone. Okay, guys, we're going to go Magestone. We don't want to go to Riverdale or else the plot of this... <laughs> the plot of this choose-your-own-adventure is going to go crazy. 
Okay, there we go. We've activated the mage stone. There it is doing a little glow. This, by the way, from a viewpoint point of view, is one of the prettiest viewpoints in Skyrim. Careful there, friend. Oh, look, here we go. Nice. But like this here, I think is one of the nicest views in Skyrim. I just think it's so pretty. I'm, I did a screenshot because I like it so much. Look at that. In fact, what's um what's reducing my powers right now? Oh, I'm hungry and tired. Fair enough. Um, but yeah, I love that. That is just like quintessential Skyrim to me. Whenever I see that, I just like I know exactly where it is if I see this picture, and it's just like so beautiful Skyrim. So, um, okay. Thank you guys for your vote. We have activated the Mage Stone, so we're gonna start learning our magic skills a little bit quicker. But for now, we're gonna head our cute little butts back into Riverwood. <laughs> um, so we can rest for the night, warn the citizens, and kind of figure out what our next steps are. Yeah, we'll be able to level up once we rest. Caden is very overprotective over us. Caden, I feel like, is written in a very... from a romantic point of view. Like, he's kind of made for, like... He's, he's definitely, there's not many male followers that are like, actually, no, there is. There's Indigo as well. But he's made from like a simp point of view, for sure. Um, I've tried The Witcher, um, but I haven't had like really a chance to get into it. And I I've tried Breath you. of the Wild. <gasps> you have a gift for me? Did I see you <gasps> talking to Sven? Maybe not. She Maybe. gave me a diamond. But I would oh, stay th that's Fendor. Good to see a familiar face so far from home. Um, he called me Sister Elf, which is so nice. However, you are not attractive enough, enough to be in my gang. I'm sorry. He's a bard, so he says. Occasionally, he finds time to do his job here at the mill. Thinks his ballads and sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him. As if she would say yes. An intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. You hope? I've been thinking. Maybe Camilla needs a little help seeing Sven for what he is. Could you, could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? I think I've matched that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. Oh, I don't want to get into your little weird oh, love so triangle. Why are you so old looking? I swear he wasn't usually that old. Anyway, we're here to warn the citizens of Riverwood <laughs> about the scary dragons. So... Let's go ahead and do that. This is such a nice little part of the world. Um, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going for that, though. Warn them? I thought it was, like, over here. Maybe it's in someone's house, though. Let me have a little nose. I thought it was, like, over here. Rivet Riverwood is so pretty. <laughs> I'm desperate to say Riverdale. What's the Lord of the Ringsy place that has a river? in the name or is have i just made that one up too riverdale oh that's why i thought it was lord of the rings see that's what i thought i was getting it confused with Get lost in the um okay i'm gonna do that one too i think it's better to break things up and know them you know it's the black blacksmith guy okay let's head inside then I thought there was like a woman out here that you spoke to for some reason. Did her? Not sure you belong here, Elf. Tell me again why I'm helping you. A dragon in Helgen? It can't be. Although it would explain what I saw earlier, flying down the valley from the south. I thought I must have just been seeing things. The dragon flew off this way. You must have seen right. it. I saw it, but how's that possible? We want them, guys, even exist. though they were mean to us. Just from long she ago. looks angry, right? I don't know why, but I actually believe you. You've got the look of someone who's just seen a dragon. It's because I have Things my angry face on today. To worse. First the war, now dragons. What's this world coming to? It's crazy, right? It's crazy. Inflation's out of control. Student loans are out of control. To Jarl in to send so property prices. Property prices, Gerda. Have you seen them? Wild. Good day to you too, Gerda. I'm glad you decided to be less mean to me. Um, okay, so we've warned the citizens. Wait, did she, what, what did she actually tell me to do? Because I definitely did not listen. Um, I think she wanted me to... 
Trouble in Skyrim? No. Talk to the Yarl of Whiterun. That's what she wanted me to do. Yeah. So that's the next thing we could do if we want to start absorbing some dragon souls. They're very tasty. Um, but for now, I need to west, uh, rest my weary head. And this is the Sleeping Giant Inn. So, oh, hello, Stump. Hi. Have you guys ever seen these dogs in the wild? I think it's called um, an Irish wolfhound, is it? They are the biggest dog in terms of actual height, although Great Danes overall are bigger, I think. I think like poor to floor, the Irish scared? wolfhound is the biggest dog breed. But Great Dane is still the biggest overall dog breed. Are you listening? Hard not I like to. my dog Vesax. Hi, Ogna. We got rooms and food. Drink too. I cook. Um, much else to tell. That's cool. I, I need a bed Until to stay in. Time. Can I stay Your here? That visitor been poking around. You guys are all so mean to me. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. That's all I wanted. Okay, I didn't need Did your you rudeness. Yep. Ale's going. Rude. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a drink. Boop boop boop. Well, boo. Let me know if you want anything. Think yeah, everyone's kind of somewhere. mean to me, right? Let's see who we got in here. So this is Sven. Something. If we want to screw over the elf outside, we can tell Sven that he plans to... We could get involved in this love triangle. Okay, how to solve the love triangle. Do we help the elf and screw over and uh, screw over Sven? Do we tell Sven about the note? Or do we say... Do we do nothing? Let me know what you guys want to do. Is choose your own adventure, don't forget. Banana Mug, thank you so much for the win. Two, three, four, five. Vince, just pop in to send you lots of love. Stay healthy. You stay healthy too. We can also tell Camilla that the elf tried to lie. Ah, uh, okay. Maybe do we do that Stop. one for the nothing one then? I'm going to sit my little butt down. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, my tired, weary head. I've been doing so much walking. Why have I got... Oh, my... Uh, my. Hmm, I don't like that that goes over my face. But oh well. Uh, someone going to offer me a drink. You are lazy. Lazy article. Okay. I guess I'll eat my cheese myself. Not going to eat some raw dog meat. Leg of goat roast. Okay. Nom nom nom. I'm still peckish. Oh, that's a lot of food. Irish wolfhounds are like gentle giants. I've only probably seen like five or six in my, in my time. What time is it? Oh, it feels so silly. Help the elf. Wait, I put help to elf. Okay, you want me to help the elf. Right, where is... Oh, you look shocked. You okay, friend? Okay, just have a drink. Got any ale or mead? Yeah, here you go. That's all I got. Till next time. Okay. <laughs> Why do I keep helping the alcoholics of Skyrim? Right, let's go find Camilla. I think she works in the shop. That's the elf. He can help us with his archery. I don't know if he gives you a better price if you help him. I don't know. Well, one of us has to do something. He gives moolah. I ah. Said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Whoa. Oh, easy. Whoa, Maybe whoa, you could talk some sense into my pig-headed brother. Glad to hear that. Uh, you guys want to help the elf, so we're going to skip the letter and say it was from Sven. Another poem, I bet. On the road he does know how to make it grow She's blush. very cute. Oh, what's less this? Commerce means if less that elf thinks all I'm going to do is stay in that, that filthy house of his and harm. clean, I'll... You can tell Sven that he already has a mother. <laughs> I'm not speaking to him anymore. <laughs> Until next time. Huh? <gasps> oh my gosh, we'll get some money from Fendel for that. That makes two well, I don't... Uh, yeah, we... we oh, a dang! A an ornament, solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Ooh, I can go get you the claw. You could. Pop off, I've Camilla. Got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. We can do that, but I need to sell Show some things. Take a look. Right. What can I sell? Um, I would like to enchant those, so I don't want to sell them. This is my absolutely. Garbage fur mantle that increase your magic by 1%. <laughs> I will sell those. We'll sell these Thalmor things that we killed. 
Uh, you can have that. I'm not bothered for it. It's fine. Uh, you can have this taro. You can have a quarter stuff. You can have a steel longsword. You can have this bow. And you can have this bow. And you can have this book. Um, ooh, I need to learn that. You can have this book. You can have this book. And you can have this book. And you can have none of these because they're cool. And you can have um, this, 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 this. Because I never bother with poisoning. It's boring. I uh, never fortify myself. I don't need fortify and I'm, I'm good enough on my own. And you can have this skooma because we don't want to become an addict. You can also have this. And we don't bother with resistance. No, you actually no, no, sir. Lots right. of money for us. I am giving him every. Wait, no, I, I was, I wasn't at the end. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. And right, where is the elf? What's the hurry? Elf boy, where have you gone, little elf? We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The You're not the elf. Every day we get visitors in Riverwood. Gosh, people oh, really don't God. like new newcomers here, do they? I've got nothing cool I can make yet. Um, how do we enchant? We use the same table that we use to... Uh, why are all the kids staring at me? Weird. Um, mm -hmm. The same table that you use to disenchant, you can use to enchant. However, I don't think I have any soul gems. So... Is this the Jarl's house? No. Maybe they don't have a Jarl here. Where did Fendel go? Give me my money. Maybe he went for a little bevy. Did he go in here for a little bev beverage? A little beverage, eh? No, he didn't. Where is the fool? Give me my money. I interfered with your love life, which is just so below me my station, you know? But I did it. So now I would like my monies, please. Here he is, they cutting some logs. Tell Sackhouse. me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. I appreciate your help. No, please take this. Some gold I've saved up from working at the mill. Twenty-five gold. We just sold out Stay all vigilant. of our morals for twenty-five gold. Well, I thought you might at least give me one hundred. Twenty-five gold. I should have helped Sven. Just like Cupid. Wow, I just got royally. I can't believe that. Camilla, it was all a lie. This way. Oh man. Right. Watch what you're doing. I will not. I'll do no such thing. Is this where the all no the trade wait we need to sleep. That's what I need to do, because we need to level up, don't we? Fendor is a master archer. Well, gimme give gimme give two more episodes. And I will be too. It's been kind of awkward Don't for you, but anything to say to you. Fair enough. Fair enough. I was just going to inform you of what I've did, but you already know. So we're all on the same page. Everyone knows what's going on. It's fine. <laughs> okay, guys, 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 guys. I think we've earned it. Did you just say something was a good luck on me? Are you going to sit and watch me sleep? Okay. What do you Any need? thoughts? Hey, nothing really. Oh, okay. Um. Okay. What did you want to know? Right. What did you want to know? What do we level up? Do we do magicking? Do we do fighting? Do we do armoring? Or do we do snicking? Let me know what you guys want. And mods, if you could just remind me what got voted on last time. Uh, Phantom S uh, oh, for the magicka stamina or health um and fancy mess of kalia thank you so much for the 18 months in a row hope you've had a good 18 months what are your best skills Put a war ball in my hands when we're fighting a dragon and i'll tear that worm from the skies yeah i stole your Archery bow takes a lot of strength more than people realize yeah i stole your bow okay Quote. of course what were you wondering i've spent a long time wondering <laughs> this is where my feet led me uh, that's the small to that, no, right? Isn't there always? To the truth, I've come back to Skyrim. Don't know why the audio does my that. Heritage, my bloodline. The few clues that I have pointed me here. 
but it takes time to the cool. Ah, so he has a story. So I think he has I'm some missions. Way by collecting bounties. You don't look like a Nord. Well, aren't you observant? I was raised by a Nord. And as one. But no, that Admore and Ice doesn't run in my veins. Can't be certain it does. So he wants to find out his heritage, and I think you can like help him. I think that's kind of part of it. No. I have no voice of the Emperor. No dragon skin magic. I don't know the race of my mother. All I have is a hunch, but I need proof. You guys love his voice. <laughs> you do that. I love Sports this. You help. guys want to level up sneaking, Best okay? I have is my sword, but I'm certain we can find out more in our travels. Okay, so we can try and help him as we travel, which I think is quite cool. Mm -hmm. He's going to watch over as well. No, he's like, no, it's creepy. I've decided. Well done, Caden. Door's there. Oh, guys? Yes. Okay, I'm, I'm going to sleep. You guys do you. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to have a solid 11 hours on myself. And... Okay, what did you guys say? Sorry, mods. What was the answer for the first part of the leveler? Yeah, I... Kira, I hear that on his accent as well. I Sometimes he sounds northern and sometimes he doesn't. Like, I completely agree. He, his accent's a bit all over the place for me. Um, which one did we decide here? Because we got another leveler. While you guys are reminding me, let me just do a poll for E. Ooh, Antas has just called me. <laughs> um, which sneaking skill? So we can do just general sneak. We can do lock picking. We can do pick pocket. We can do archery. Um, and I can't remember the other one. Let's go for those four. Which is another good skill? Maybe those four. Oh, was it magicka? Okay, sorry. Which magic? We've got destruction we've got healing we've got alteration we've got illusion and we've got wait what was the final magic destruction healing alt oh conjuration okay get voting guys and sorry i've completely missed what was the one for this was it magicka no it was sneaking oh my gosh this was magicka okay <laughs> Right, I'm going to mute while I'm typing these in so I can answer the phone, Satan. I'm back. Um, lock picking, pickpocket, uh, speech. Those are the sneaking ones. I'm going to put um, archery on there as well because I just feel like it's a really good sneaky one. So, yeah. And a light change to blue. Okay, let's do a little blue light change while you guys is voting. And that's where we're going to leave things because I am going to collect TARS, but I'm going to give you guys a poll for what we do next episode. Yeah, I muted while I was talking to Taz. That's it, don't worry. Um, just because I don't I don't think you should um, call somebody and put them on stream without them knowing, you know? Okay, which skill tree are we thinking? I know that archery is technically a fighting skill, but I associate it so much with sneaking that I've just thrown it in there. And we'll be next playing Skyrim next le next week, Jua. Oh, do one of my little puppers. It's Elixie. Hello. Hello. Hello, cheeky bum. Do you want to come with me to collect um, cars? I think you should. Okay, the sneaking skill you guys have decided on is archery. Okay, I'm glad I threw that in there because I do kind of align it with it. Um, and I am just going to add... I'm going to get our base archery up so that we can start doing the cool skills after that. I'm going to F5 to save. And then I'm going to see what we do next time. Because we've got a few options. So, 
next time do we want to start by um telling them about the dragons at white room do we want to continue helping do we want to go to riftum where we can one exper experience the thief skills but also kill that evil um orphanage owner do we want to do the white file quest that we got when we were in uh windhelm or do we want to what are the other ones that are quite big on there what's trouble in skyrim I well put trouble in skyrim i think it's a mission but it could be quite fun or do we want to get a little bit more we're going to be going to win if we go to white run we could potentially go back to the companions and get a little bit more i hate to use the term in bed with them but you know what i mean we'll hang out with the um hang out with those a bit more and do a little bit more of that quest line Trouble in Skyrim is this group of warlocks that have been causing trouble. It's just us doing a little bit of a quest. It's just a way to start things. Um, the White File is the alchemist in Windhelm. Um, this is the killing the orphanage owner. Innocence Lost, it's that kid that wants revenge for what happened to him. Or we can go tell the Jarl of White Ring about the dragon attack and absorb our first ever dragon soul. They're all fun options. So... Whichever you guys prefer. Kay Gilly, thank you so much for the 16 months in a row and 18 months in total. Um, I'm so glad you found me five years ago as well. And I hope you and your family are doing well too. If you're on YouTube, I'm going to drop the same options in. Uh, I'm going to drop the exact same options below. All you got to do is like the comment. If you see my pinned comment, like the comment that has the option you guys would like to do. Here on YouTube, uh, sorry, here on Twitch, with uh, 156 votes, Riften has won. Uh, telling at uh, White Run has 69 votes in second. Trouble in Skyrim has 12. Companions has seven. And uh, the White File has three votes. So Riften is winning for Twitch. But who will be winning for uh, YouTube? I add all of your votes together so everyone gets an equal vote. And I hope you guys have enjoyed today's stream. I'm sorry to bounce off immediately without a raid, but I don't want to leave little Tashula in the in the cold because um, she's waiting for me now. So I'm going to go and collect her with Lexi and I will see you guys soon. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. There is a video on my main channel tonight as well. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Lexi's here. <laughs>